Hey there, I'm Brock Campbell, lead newscaster here at South Point, and this is my partner, May. May. And we're here to give you the scoop on everything South Point. Hey, but first, we want to welcome all of our guests. We hope there's a bunch of you out there today. Hey, if you didn't get a connection card when you came through the door, find somebody, get one, find a pin, that's the hard part. Fill it out, leave it anywhere, just make sure that it stays here in the church. We'll find it, we'll get you on the list, and we'll call you and make sure you stay in touch with everything that's going on here at South Point. We want to break it down here and let you know what South Point's all about, and that is making connections with people. And because of that, we have this amazing thing called connection groups. We've got tons of them. They're just going on all over the place all the time. But here's a quick list of them. And we've got the 20s and 30s group that's led by Lee Prince. We have the motorcycle ministry, which is led by the one and only Pastor Jerry. We've got Top Notch, and that's led by Barbara. We've got the 40s and 50s group, which is just getting back on its feet. We'll look for more news on that coming up soon. We've got the Real Men's Ministry, which is all about being a man. And we've got the Women's Ministry, which is known as SOS. And then everybody's favorite is Diners, Drive-Ins, and Jesus. And all we do is get together, go out somewhere, eat, and have some good fellowship. And speaking of connection groups, this Tuesday at 7 p.m., Real Men's Ministry. Be here so you can have some free, manly food. Yeah! All right, we're going to go ahead and cut over to Pastor Jerry and Brother Danny, who are going to give us the scoop on the Sunday School Smackdown, which has been going on here Saturday. Well, Brother Danny, how are you doing, Brother Danny? Doing good, how's everything? We're doing good. Hey, we've been having this uh, Smackdown all summer long about my class versus your class. I want to see which class was the largest. And so we had a big contest and all this, and we had a deal going that, you know, that, you know, that my class or your class was going to have to cook dinner for the class and lost. So what are we having? We hadn't announced yet who was lost. Oh, okay. So today we're going to make it, so we need a drum roll. <laughs> <laughs> the drum roll was pretty weak, but here it is. Brother Danny's class averaged 26. Every sun on a Sunday throughout that last month. My class averaged 27. Guys, this is all wrong. He's <laughs> lying to you right here in the church. No, my class averaged 22. So, brother Danny's class is one. He averaged 30, but go ahead. <laughs> so, what happened now is that we gave brother Danny a beer classroom because he's growing so much. And, and we're, we're so happy about what's going on in Sunday school. It starts at 10 o'clock. You need to come and be part of it. You'll enjoy it. Come and be part of it. But then you got lucky. Are we off camera now? <laughs> How many times have I told you, feet off the coffee table? Sheesh! You scared the stuffing out of me. Where you been all day anyway? I have been getting ready for Thanksgiving. Oh, you mean the apocalypse? Okay, now I know that Thanksgiving isn't the best time of the year for turkeys, but it's not a time to be cynical. It's a time to stop and count your blessings. <laughs> no, right, right. Easy for you to say, Mr. Positive Pilgrim. Mr. My life's perfect because I've got buckles on my shoes and my hat doubles as a hot tub. Okay, now stop. You stop! Just listen to me. You listen! Okay, I'm listening. Hi. I don't have anything to say. I just... Alright, okay. Bring it in. Come on. 
Come on, let's hug it out. Who's your buddy? Who's your pal? I am, that's right. Now look, I know what you're going through. I've had my share of my own midlife crises. Like what? Hmm. Trust me, this too shall pass. Yeah. But what do I have to be thankful for? I mean, look at me. I live in your house. I sleep on your couch. I eat your food. My life is a wreck. And besides that, I have not seen or heard from my brother Larry in over a week, and I can't even grow a decent beard. <sighs> what kind of turkey am I? You are the type of turkey that's not going to allow circumstances to dictate your joy. You are going to have a more thankful perspective. What you talking about, Pilgrim? I'll tell you what I'm talking about. Do you have a place to live? We'll be thankful for that. Do you have a place to lay your head down at night? Yeah. We'll be thankful for that. Are you getting enough to eat? Yeah. Seriously, I need to know if you're getting enough to eat. Yeah. It's like you're trying to fatten me up more than you know. All I'm saying is let's not focus on what we don't have, but focus on what God has already blessed us with. You're right. I am a blessed turkey. Yes, and you're about to bless a whole pilgrim village. Mm -hmm. Never mind. Hey, I am hungry. You want something to eat? You betcha, pilgrim. Hey, I forgot about these leftovers. Hey, speaking of Thanksgiving, now it's time for the Big Scoop! And the Big Scoop this week is our second annual Thanksgiving dinner going on today right after church. Hey, tell me about it. Everyone in the building is required to go. It's at the Senior Activity Center right down the road. If you don't know how to get there, find somebody, you'll get there. Everybody's going. You can't miss it. Just to reinforce, everyone who is in this building, if you're watching us, you're required to go. Come on down, we've got free food, turkey, hopefully some pies, we've got stuffing, we've got all this great stuff. It's going to be amazing and you don't want to miss it. Go! Is... Thanks for that, Pastor. Way to ruin Brock's mojo. Alright, that's it for the South Point Scoop today. Hey, I'm Brock Campbell. Don't forget, where do you want to be when Jesus comes back? Eat turkey. Brock <laughs> can.